Hello, my name is Joseph Salazar, Technical Marketing for Ativo Networks, and I'm going to briefly demonstrate the Ativo Networks AD Assessor solution. The AD Assessor solution provides organizations with the continuous visibility they need to secure Active Directory by conducting assessments on the domain controllers. These assessments will identify vulnerabilities and weaknesses that attackers can exploit by revealing and providing remediation guidance for exposures and misconfigurations to the domain, users, and devices that leave them open to attack. By identifying and remediating these issues, organizations can reduce their Active Directory attack surface. It also detects mass changes to Active Directory objects in real time, indicating an attack is underway and providing early warning for organizations to derail these activities that would usually go undetected. So, without further ado, Let's dive right in. This is the AD Assessor dashboard. It provides a quick overview of the current state of the Active Directory domain. On the upper left are the results from the most recent assessments. It breaks down the exposures by severity and provides the data in a graph or table view. It also provides a health score and a risk rating based on the number of exposures it has identified. To the right is the domain view, which shows the domain in either a topology view or by trusts. Above that are some quick trigger buttons to trigger analysis or download the reports for the most recent sets of assessments. The drop-down can also show you other domains that are part of the AD Assessor de deployment. Below this row is a quick summary of the domain, user, and computer exposures it has identified. Next are the six most vulnerable findings based on severity and number. On the bottom right is a line graph showing the results of the recent assessments by finding severity to track improvements or new exposures as they appear. Next to that is the integrations with the Antivo Network's AD Secure Solution which shows any Active Directory attack detections. The AD Secure Solution can also hide Active Directory objects related to the vulnerabilities reported by the AD Assessor Solution. To access this function, click on the Improve Protection button underneath the Health Score and Risk Rating. This opens the Improve Protection Wizard, which offers two choices of either securing with AD Secure or with AD Assessor. The Secure with AD Secure button will open a page for signing up if there is no AD Secure license detected. Otherwise, it will open up the AD Secure Protection Wizard like so. The integration allows for viewing the exposure either by privilege or by exposures. In either case, we can expand the table below to identify the privileges that the AD Secure solution will protect. For example, the domain admin user, Shiva1, has five exposures. Once we've selected the objects, we can then select the protection policies and continue the wizard. Here, we can choose to configure the AD Secure protection policies. We can select Alert Only or Alert and Engage, in which case the AD Secure solution will hide the protected objects and return decoy results in their place. Going back to the dashboard and the Improve Protection Wizard, we can select Secure with the AD Secure button, which brings us to the exposure list and shows us the exposure results. Each exposure has a details link that gives information on the finding. Let's look at the unusual accounts with replication permissions exposure for an example. Notice that it gives the severity, the MITRE attack tactic, a quick summary of the exposure, the mitigation steps, and any known attack tools that can take advantage of the exposure, and the reference if you want to do more research. We can use this information to remediate the exposure. This particular exposure leaves the domain controller open to a DC sync attack, 
by allowing an attacker to use Mimikatz to impersonate a domain controller and request password hashes from the other domain controllers without executing any code on the target. With these hashes, the attacker can then launch subsequent attacks like a golden ticket attack. Expanding the exposure and clicking the view link shows us the affected objects. We can then go into the Active Directory and change these objects to remove the Replicate Directory change privilege and mitigate the exposure. An upcoming enhancement will create the PowerShell script to automate the remediation. We can also access the exposures by clicking on the tab directly or by clicking on any of the active links such as the Vulnerable Findings by Severity or the delegated admins, the privileged users, the service accounts, and any other link that you can find and hover over. That concludes a quick demo of the AD Assessor solution, as well as a glimpse into its integration with the AD Secure solution. To get more information, request a demo, or inquire about our other free trial offers, please visit our website at www.ativonetworks.com. Thank you very much.